My name is Gary Messmer. I'm from Mandan, North Dakota, and I've spent the last 15 years restoring this 1948 21-foot custom-built Honduras mahogany oak cockpit and trim twin cockpit, twin windshield runabout boat. It's 72 years old. I've enclosed a photo of the brass plate with the serial number and the year of the boat. Uh, I've owned this boat for 38 years and started restoring it 15 years ago. I am the third owner on this boat. I started on the restoration of this boat 15 years ago. I removed everything from the inside, the floor, all the side trim that hides the what's behind it on the sides of the boat. I have replaced one board in the transom due to it being cracked. Sure is where I removed the floor inside uh, and cleaned the bilge area out. Picture it's me cleaning and scraping the bilge area. And which is me using 3M5200 to caulk all the seams under the floor. After finish stripping the inside of the boat, I moved to the exterior. I turned the boat upside down. I stripped it to the original wood. Then I moved to the top of the boat and stripped it to the original wood, replacing the center board in the deck due to there being a gas fill spout in that board. Then I moved to the transom, which I replaced one board in the transom above the exhaust. And the next picture is the size of the boat being stripped the picture shows the front of the boat under the deck after being primed and repainted. Picture of the transom of the boat after priming and repainting. Picture of the floor replaced in the boat after priming and painting both sides of the board and painting the bilge. I started staining on the rear of the boat using mahogany stain. I moved from the transom to the interior decks and sides, finishing up at the deck. I moved on to varnishing the sides and the top. I used 15 coats of varnish. The power plant in the boat is a 1948 Ford V8 flathead, 110 horsepower, with a Mohawk Marine conversion for the water jackets, the transmission, and the pump system. I have a picture of the uh, the ignition switch and original basil that it came with. A picture of the throttle and the cable run into the carburetor. The exhaust coming out the rear of the boat. The gas tank which has never had gas in it yet since it's been restored. Uh, the 12 volt for the bilge pump box and then the battery to start the engine. A uh, picture of the interior of the boat. Uh, the whole inside has been redone and it's never been out of the shop since it's been redone. Under the boat, uh, there's a picture of the hangar, which houses the shaft and the prop. The rudder behind the prop. It has a custom built trailer cradle that fits the boat perfectly, has new bearings, 
new tires, uh, new seals, wiring, tail lights. The summary on this boat is it's a 1948 21-foot custom-built Honduras mahogany twin cockpit runabout. I've owned the boat for 36 years already. I am the third owner on the boat. Uh, from the pictures you can tell what it is. Uh, it's been totally uh, restored. Not professional. I'm not a professional restorer, but it's nice. And it's not supposed to look like a brand new off the showroom boat. It's a 72 year old boat that has got a nice restoration on it. It's never been taken out on the water since the restoration was finished. There's never been gas in the gas tank. Uh, it's turnkey outfit, uh, new batteries, new fuel tanks, uh, new engine. Uh, it's looking for an owner, that's all. My name is Gary Messmer. Phone number 701-214-8500. I'm asking $49,900 for this 1948 21-foot custom-built Honduras Mahogany twin cockpit runabout. Thank you.